what we do here is go back, 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 back. back. Hey everyone, it's your girl Nunu the Hair Diva and I'm back with you with a special video. Thank you so much if you had stuck by my empties video. I know it was quite long, but I did some mini reviews. If by chance you looked at the time and decided not to watch it, I will leave the link below this video. I think you would truly like it. It is the last empties for December. This particular video here that you see are all the items that I and my uh, son and daughter have completed for the last two or three months. I have done this video three times within this year. This is video number four. Starting next year, I will start to label them one through four. Pretty much this is to show proof of the items that we have used as well as to let you know that we enjoy using them. Also, towards the end of this video, I will tell you a average price of the total of all of these items that uh, we have gone through. So normally I start right about here. This large section that you see here is all of the makeup and skincare. We have Clean and Clear, Ulta Clarifying, Witch Hazel, Elf, uh, Lock and Seal, Mascara, Lip Balms. We also have some samples. Baby Girl went through a foundation. I need to get on the ball. This is Brush Cleaner some moisturizer we have a victoria's secret primer the spray uh what is that remo stay mac we also have some neutrogena we have a brush head for the clarisonic clinique uh moisturizer we also have the pineapple mask some moonlight path curel eye pencils eye drops lipsticks and some more moisturizer those are items that we have gone through as you come down here i have gone through personally two packagings of the 100 cotton balls just for my nails right here in the front is three packagings of the cotton rounds and I use those for my face as well as eye makeup remover wipes. Down here we have two pack, three packages of Pond, some baby wipes, two packages of Al May, as well as this God forsaken <laughs> pack of exfoliating wipes that I still need to get my dollar for. If many of you are laughing, you already know why I said that. Those are the wipes that we have gone through. In this little section here, we have some scents. There were oils, there were beads, there were wallflowers, and some from the supermarket, some air wicks that we were trying out. Next to it is all of the nail care, matte top coats, gel top coats, strengtheners, buffing blocks, uh, creams for your feet. We had uh, gone through an entire nail wheel of designs. Two bottles of acetone, and you can see they are quite large, as well as a file and um, a brush that just didn't work too well. Down here in the front, we have toothpaste, razors, mouthwash, as well as my favorite, this Nair uh, shower power. I actually have one I'm working on and one as a backup. This stuff works wonders. Doesn't smell good, but it works wonders. Over here, 
from Bath and Body Works, we have uh, your liquid soaps. This was the regular liquid soap in Moonlight Path. This one was the gentle foaming soap in Coconut Lime Verbena. Moonlight Path is my favorite. This one, it's okay. I maybe purchase it again. Right here, we have some hair care. We have Old School Ultra Shame. Mm-hmm. This is the smaller container. We have Old School Iso Plus. We have some Mazzani uh, cold wash samples, dark and lovely conditioner, John Frieda volumizer, and some new expressions Super 10. We're going to come right over here these are some of the drinks that i have told you about that i love you got the hawaiian punch you got the kool-aid zero calories and this one that is watermelon tastes like watermelon jolly ranchers we also have the hair skin and nail gummies this one in particular was 220 count sam's club want to try to find those good price also we have the celestial teas raspberry zingers it keeps me calm lets me sleep wonderful right here we have two degrees uh deodorant we have one that is the stick one that is the dry spray i prefer the dry spray but i like to alternate so that my body doesn't get used to one over the other Right here in this area, we have a plethora of fragrances. Remember when we finished the Lady Gaga? And we also finished out this Ulta Fresh Water Mist. Here is the Lady Gaga uh, perfume, and that was the cream. We also. the ones that my son has gone through the power stick as well as the old spice bear glove we also have used up i think we used up two of these swabs one of them may have gone in the trash but this was also a sam's club find these here are my favorites and those are the dollar shower gels that i get from the dollar general the St. Ives was Baby Girl, and the fresh water actually came from Ulta. All right, so this is all of the items that we have gone through for the last three months. I want to say, as I look at everything, the average price for all of these items that are on here, because you have to remember, not everything was on sale. Most of these items were full price, but some of these items were gifts. So with the fragrances and things included, I want to say we hit right around maybe $230, $230, because you have to remember that some of these items here are full price they're not always on sale and they range between almost fourteen dollars down to five dollars and then some of the shower gels were 5.99 the dry sprays probably in the three to seven dollar range and you know how much the Bath and Body Works stuff costs. So yes, I just wanted to come in and show you this. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, by all means, leave that below. To all be blessed. Wear your makeup. Save your money. Take a look at all the items that you go through. And Nuna will see you in a few days with the next video. Bye.